Hello, what's up, YouTube? This is RoboWarrior62 here. I know I've been gone a long time. Well, these past few weeks, I've been a huge blur, really busy with a lot of stuff. Finally got my hands on the iPhone 5. Uh, I'll have a review video of that, too. Also, the iPod Touch 5 generation, I have it, too. I'll have a review for that real soon. But right now, I want to do a Scream Truck review that's sent out to me by iFrogs. So I want to give them a big thank you. And um, it's a privacy screen protector. But ultra durable, durable privacy film screen protector, and as you can see, it's official with that sticker logo thingy. And um, uh, it says iPhone 4 there, which also works for the 4S. Um, they also have an iPhone 5 version. I'll have a link for the iPhone 5 version in the description below. Side got nothing. Back here got nothing. Just a lot of uh, really. That's that's basically what's about the box. I've already unboxed it. I've already installed it. Didn't see a need to put you guys through that. But, um, yeah, so it comes with a huge, huge uh, microfiber cleaning cloth with iFrog's branding right there. Now, I mean, this is really big. Okay, this is the average microfiber. This is like a, th this one. So, so it's a good thing they added an extra big one. But um, it doesn't make up for a horrible, horrible squeegee. And this is like one of the worst squeegees I've ever seen or tried. It says it has the iFrog's website on it, and every time you use it, it starts bending. You see, I've bent it right there, and it's just horrible. So that's enough with the accessories. I just see I have it installed over here, and I, uh, and there's a few bubbles on here which I can take out easily, but um, I'm not because I'm going to show you why I got how I got these bubbles. I mean, so uh, let me just get my iPod out of my pocket so I can uh, do a little comparison here. So um, yeah, so uh, I'm just gonna unlock the device. Um, oh man, I should have done this before. Okay, just a second. I gotta put the brightness down. Sorry about that. So, um, uh, yeah, so, just go into my settings, I really should have done this later, I mean earlier, <laughs> okay, so, uh, I think that's, uh, light enough, yep, that's light enough, and, uh, as you can see, they're at, that, that, nope, not the same brightness, uh, yeah, that, that, they're, they're about the same brightness now, this was a little bit, yeah, that, that, whoops, um, yeah, that looks about the same. So I have I have these on the same brightness right now, and um, as you can see right now, I turned off auto brightness to show the differences of the what the screen protector does. So as you can see, a really odd thing happens when I turn these. As you can see, if I turn them to this side, you can still see my iPod, but this kind of dims out. As you can see, you can still see my iPod screen, but this one dims out. It's, right now, it's like completely black. You guys probably can't even see anything. Here, let me turn the brightness up just a bit. To give you guys a better look at that, uh, oops, yep, uh, okay, so, um, so, yeah, so as you can see, it gets really dark right there, so, like, it's basically a privacy film, so, like, if you're, like, on an app that you don't want anyone to see, your credit card, whatever you're on, you don't want anyone to see it, so if someone from the side just wants to peek over, they can't really see it, because it'll be dimmed out, so, yeah, and uh, it's thick, protects your screen, doesn't have a backside, obviously. Why would you need a backside? But um, it's good. I really like it. But now there's the huge, huge, huge con about this. And the con is that it does not fit cases. That is why I have all these bubbles on the top. See, now watch what happens when I put this uh, Incipio NGP case on. As you can see, it's already already coming on top. I mean, it works with some cases, but does not with most. Look at that. Look at Just look at look at how that's coming off. So yeah, just just for that reason, I'm gonna give it like um 2.5 out of a five. I mean, uh, let's go for 3.5 out of five, mainly because um it just can't fit cases. So it's either your screen or your device. <laughs> I mean, who'd like um yeah? I mean, really, but uh. I don't know, iPhone 5 version might be different. I don't know, might try it out, might not. So, hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to rate, like, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook fan page, and also add me as a friend on Facebook. Also, made an Instagram, make sure to follow me on that. All the links for, even my Google Plus, I use that sometimes. All the links for that will be in the description below. And, yeah, sorry for the super late video after a really long time. And, guess that's it. Peace.